Hello everybody and welcome to my channel. My name is Martha and we are doing another pregnancy update. Today we are doing weeks 19 and 20 combined. I normally like to do weekly updates. That way you can get, you know, a shot of the bump for every week. But could not do one last week due to some technical difficulties that I was having. So like I said, they will be combined. All right, so let's start off with the baby's stats uh, like we normally do. So for week 19, my app said that baby boy was the size of a mango, measuring at 5.98 inches, so more like six, and eight and a half ounces. Says that he was developing a protective coating all over his skin called the vernix caseosa, and he was working on his five senses says nerve cells for sense of taste, hearing, sight, and smell are developing in his brain. For week 20, it says that he was the size of a banana and he was 6.5 inches long and 10.1 ounces. So from week 19 to week 20, he grew about a half an inch and one and a half ounces. Ooh, buddy. It also says that he is working on his taste buds and he is now gulping down several ounces of amniotic fluid. So before we talk about symptoms that I've been dealing with and that the app mentions, some exciting things happened. I had my 20 week ultrasound and we are officially halfway through this pregnancy. We, I mean me, I am officially halfway through this pregnancy, which is crazy and it just blows my mind that in potentially 20 weeks, I could be meeting my sweet baby boy. It also makes me a little bit emotional because I'm so in love with him and I am so excited to be his mom and to have a baby, just to have my little boy. Ah, okay, so let's move on to the appointment. I went in how far along was I? So I went into my appointment, I was 19 weeks and three days. They did the ultrasound and measured everything on him. Like when I say everything, I mean everything, like his brain, his stomach, his heart, his kidneys, his legs, arms, um, everything. <laughs> But the good thing is, is they said that he is measuring perfectly. They didn't tell me how much he weighs. I don't know if the ultrasound that they have does that. But I peeked over at the screen and it says that he was measuring at about 20 weeks and a couple days. Which he's always been ahead, but my doctor just has decided to not change the date. So little boy is measuring a little bit bigger than normal, but we'll see if that is an indication of him coming earlier or not. I kind of have a feeling that he might come just a little bit earlier, especially because I'm so small and I think he's gonna run out of room really quick. And you guys will see how big my belly has gotten at the end of this video. Baby boy is growing and he is big. I ended up getting a ton of pictures from this ultrasound, which was super exciting. And I also got to see for myself at the ultrasound that he is a boy, <laughs> which obviously if you saw my last video, then you know that we found out, but I didn't get to see it at the last ultrasound that I had because we weren't finding out for another couple weeks. So that was kind of cool and exciting. It's uh, he's for sure a boy. There is no doubt about it. You can tell. I won't post the picture in there though because I just feel like that's kind of weird. But anyway, he is for sure a boy. All right, so let's move on to the symptoms that the app mentions. For week 19, it says aches and pains in abdomen caused by muscle stretching, dizziness or lightheadedness, leg cramps and hip pain. For week 20, it says vaginal discharge, leg cramps again, heartburn, high energy, mild swelling, and shortness of breath. I have literally experienced all of those within the past two weeks. Um, some extra ones that it doesn't mention that 
I don't know if I've mentioned in my previous videos, but one of them is acne. And I have been experiencing acne from the second that I found out that I was pregnant. It has not gone away. There was a week where it got better and I was like super excited because I thought I was finally getting that pregnancy glow and was going to be acne free for the rest of my pregnancy. But no, it has returned and it's just annoying because nobody likes to have acne all over their face. The other one that I'm pretty sure I've mentioned before is just moodiness and being irritated. Um, that one kind of comes and goes. I'm not as irritated as I was in my um, previous weeks, but I have noticed that I am more emotional, I would say. And my poor husband has to deal with me over the phone because he's still not here. But you guys, T minus 22 days. No, 21. We are three weeks away and he will be here and I'm so excited for him to finally be back home and then it will be time for us to pack up the house and move. So I don't think I've told you guys, but we are moving to Texas. So we are currently in California and we will be moving to San Antonio, Texas. So I'm really excited about that. Not super excited about traveling in the car with my two dogs for such a long period, but that'll be okay. I'm just excited to have my honey back and to get settled in at our new place. Another thing though before we end is I have been feeling baby boy move a lot and I've been able to get a couple videos of him moving so I will insert those now. It is just my absolute favorite thing to just lay around and watch him and feel him just moving all around inside of me. I am most definitely going to miss that whenever he's here, but we still have a good little while before that happens. Also, we do have a name picked out for baby boy. I don't know how I want to tell you guys. We have told like our close friends and family and I just, absolutely love it. I feel like it is the perfect name for this little boy and it just suits him perfectly <laughs> and it just makes it so real like being able to talk to him and use his name. So again I'm not sure how I want to reveal that to you guys but we'll get there eventually. <laughs> All right guys, so that pretty much sums up week 19 and 20. Thank you so much for watching. And if you like this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. And if you wanna see any of my future updates and other videos that I will post, then don't forget to hit that subscribe button. And I will see you all in my next video. Bye. So it is time for the bump shot. I am currently 20 weeks and six days and super pregnant. So here you go. All right, so this is the bump with the shirt on from the front. From the right. And from the left. Without the shirt. From the front. From the right. And from the left.